I wanna make a refreshing treat, but with only one ingredient. I'm using these mandarin oranges, so I need to peel a few of them. Good thing these are so easy to peel. These are so satisfying. You know, I grew up in the orange generation where you got an orange in your lunchbox or you took one in the morning for breakfast, and then you had to like, smell like orange fingers all day long and have peel in your fingernails. <laughs> then mandarin oranges came along and they are so easy to peel. They're so perfect. I guess I'm being a little nostalgic about my childhood. That was the other thing I remember is mandarin oranges. We never had the peel and eat kind. We had the mandarin oranges in a can or you know, if you were lucky, you had the little cups of mandarin oranges with the sweet juice. These are so much better because there's no you know, preservatives, extra sugar, extra syrup. It's just these nice little sweet orange segments. These are such a great little fruit. Can take them anywhere. They last a long time. They taste delicious. Tastes like candy. Sometimes when I have a sweet tooth, I just reach for one of these because it'll definitely satisfy the sweet tooth. How many did I do here? Is this three? I think I'm going for five for the amount I'm gonna make. He can't talk, peel, and count at the same time. My fingers are a little juicy, juicy, juicy. What I like too is you don't have to get too crazy about getting all the little strings off of here and stuff. It'll all be blended up. Just peel, 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 peel. Ooh, this is a dry one. The rest were so juicy, but it's fine. We're just going for the flavor, not for any particular texture. So you can use any container, anything you want. Just pack these up. What's nice is I can freeze these in a flat single layer, get all that air out, but Feel free, use whatever container you want, reusable bags if you have them. These are gonna go right in the freezer. Let these freeze overnight so they're nice and firm. And we're gonna turn this into a refreshing treat. This works best if you have a food processor, some nice sharp blades, put those in there. I might do two batches or add a little bit as I go. There are those ice cream machines, those creamies, those are super popular. You can do that in one of those or you can use a small food processor. Ooh, it's blending up really nicely. I'm gonna add a few more because I don't think that was quite half the bag. Now, just go to town. Be patient and wait till it's nice and creamy. I'm gonna get a spatula, help move it around a little bit. Anytime you're dealing with a food processor, just be extra careful with those blades. Little mess is fine. Almost getting there. It's nice and chopped up. We just want to loosen this up a little bit. The smell of that citrus is so good. Only takes a few minutes. This is nice and fluffy. Just trying to get everything moved around. One last time and we should be in business. That looks great. Nice and fluffy, no big chunks. And just pour it right out. Bet you if I added a little bit of vanilla to this, it'd be like a 50-50 bar. It's just an orange sickle, mandarin sorbet. But you can eat it right away. I'm gonna blend up that second batch, put a container, let it go back in the freezer and firm up a little bit. Look at that. Nice and fluffy, sweet mandarin orange treat. Nice, cool, refreshing. That's super good. Brain freeze, just a little bit. Oh my goodness. No added ingredients. It's just the natural sweetness, the natural flavor of that orange. Delightful, frosty texture. It's super good. Gonna kind of compress it a little bit, and as it melts, it'll start getting a little bit more creamy, a little bit more slushy. That blender did its job, made perfect consistency, smooth. All right, so just like at the ice cream shop, we're gonna take a big scoop, plop it right in. How good does that look? Two little scoops, just took some of your cuties, this is really great to do if you're like, if your cuties are like getting a little overripe and you don't think you're gonna finish them all, just peel them, put them in a bag, put them in the freezer, and when you're ready for a sweet treat, just blend them up. So tasty. But I think next time I make this, I'm gonna just do a little drizzle of sweetened condensed milk on here. Just add a little creaminess, a little sweetness. I think that'd be awesome. So good. Perfect dessert, perfect snack, perfect little treat.